You haven't said a word since we left the hotel. I'm all excited about showing you my alma mater. Still thinking about Wade, aren't you? Yeah. Why? Can't help it. I miss him. Even after the way he's treated you? I still love him, Neil. Mary Lynn, he, he's running around with another woman. He asked you for a divorce. He's never said that to my face. No, he just took the coward's way out, and he wrote it to you in a letter. If you ask me, you're... Neil, please. The... I appreciate your concern, but talking about it only makes it worse. I'm sorry. Subject closed. Thank you. But you see, every, everything's going to work out for the best. Before you know it, Wade is going to be nothing more than a bad memory. Not until I can forget the good ones. You know what I do whenever I've got a lot on my mind? What? Well... I go to the top of that tower. And the view, the view is, it's just incredible. And at night when the sky is clear, you can see every star. It's like any problem that you have, it just becomes so small compared to the vastness of the night sky. Well, I haven't gone stargazing in ages. Well, I sort of thought that was the case. That's why I brought you here. I thought that we could spend an hour or so getting closer to you. I mean, getting you in a better mood. Come on. I know a secret stairway. you to the hotel and I can help you study your life. Would that be okay? Yeah. Sure. I could use the help. Oh, great, great. Let's go then. Mm. Neil, hey. What the hell are you doing with Mary Lynn? Well, I was just taking her, showing her to campus. We were on my way back to, to our room, and we were just going to go over some lines, and we just wanted to see the setup first. You're an intern on this show. You're not a personal tour guide. Hey, I, I just wanted to make sure she wasn't out there on her own, that's all. Well, I'll worry about Mary Lynn. You worry about your job here. Now, go find the director and see if maybe you can do something to help us out around here. Yes, sir. Hey, what'd I tell you about that mouth of yours, Bo, huh? Bo, please. Mary Lynn, I don't want you just wandering around here by yourself. Calm down. I'll be fine. Yeah, well, and I don't want you going back to your room with, without me knowing about it or without John giving you an okay. All right? You stay right here with everybody else. Right here. Okay? Okay. okay. All right. Whatever you say. Lose the, the table. table. Yeah, yeah. Over let's here. go. I'm going to get my butt barbecue by phone unless we get no. this done now. Well, we're getting it done, sir. I've been looking all over for you. Oh, really? Yeah. Didn't Megan tell you I was over at the waterside earlier looking for you? Uh, I haven't had a chance to talk to Megan. Come on, honey, I need to talk to you. Just come Yeah, on. well, you know, maybe she doesn't want to talk to you right now, okay? Excuse me. This is between me and my wife, Neil, so butt out. Now, why is it that she's always your wife when you need something from her, but as soon as Christine comes into the Neil, picture... Neil, Neil, please. I can handle it. Did you hear that? Bye. You know, you just don't feel like yourself, Wade, do you, unless you're pushing somebody around threatening somebody. I'm going to push your face right through the wall if you don't stop sticking your nose in my face. Wait, 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 stop! Stop! Come on. Stop! Come on. Wait, 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 stop. Wait, wait, stop. What's going on here? What's the problem, Wade? This guy keeps getting in my way with my wife, and he better stop it. No, you're the one who can't take the hint, Wade. Neil, look, I can handle it, all right? Uh, Wade, we, we can talk over here. Come on. 